Hi, everybody. My mom was going through my grandparents' papers to see what she still needed to keep about the house and what she could shred. Uh, they've been dead for a long time, but we keep finding papers. And um, she found this poem in my grandfather's papers. And this poem is dedicated to Anne Weidman and Freddie Ruth Pritt and everybody else out there that's fighting cancer and those that have lost. This poem, I don't know who it's by, so author unknown. It is called, What Cancer Cannot Do. Cancer is so limited. It cannot cripple love. It cannot shatter hope. It cannot corrode faith. It cannot cut away peace. It cannot destroy confidence. It cannot kill friendship. It cannot shut out memories. It cannot silence courage. It cannot invade the soul. It cannot reduce eternal life. It cannot quench the spirit. It cannot lessen the power of the resurrection. Why must I hear, why must I bear this pain? I cannot tell. I only know my Lord does all things well. So I trust in my God, my all and all, for he will bring me through whate'er befall. Our greatest enemy is not disease, but our greatest enemy is despair. What cancer cannot do. I have lost friends to cancer. Cindy George, Freddie Ruth Pritt, and others. I'm sure you can name several, but those are two that I can name. I can name another, Ann Weidman. She's fighting stage four pancreatic cancer. It isn't a fight she's going to win. We all have our time when it's our time to go, but we can't let that time or what calls us home, like cancer, control our lives. There's a song, Live Like You Were Dying. Can't, the most fatal disease on the planet is not spoke about. The most fatal disease on the planet is one we all share. It's life. We're none of us getting out of it alive. But it can't destroy our souls. Bye, guys.